We didn't find out that I had the gene until 2002, but cancer has been part of my family since I'm a little girl. I lost my grandmother when she was 54, my aunt when she was 42, and my mother at 56. So growing up, cancer has been my story. It wasn't a question of um, whether I was going to get cancer or not, but when I was going to get it. Tara is a great example of what happens when you screen for the breast cancer gene and you find out you have it. She had bilateral mastectomies, removal of both breasts, to prevent her from getting breast cancer. So she is essentially cured of getting breast cancer. The screening and the results of screening are extraordinary. So if a woman has the BRCA gene, she has almost an 85% chance of getting breast cancer throughout her lifetime and upwards of a 40% chance of getting ovarian cancer during her lifetime. So screening really does save lives to a dramatic extent. You have the BRCA gene or you don't have the BRCA gene. Getting the information is key to, I believe, survival. For me, I was told that I went from an 87% chance of developing cancer to a 97% chance of not developing it. Those statistics speak for themselves. It has a huge impact on family dynamics because the rest of your children need to get screened and it will have an impact on, on what that, those re results are. My daughter at 19 decided that she wanted to get tested. She had been around this for a very long time and she was not fearful. What she really said to me was, I'm not afraid of whether I have it or not. I need to know whether I have it or not. I need to make decisions about myself and I need to move forward. According to my family history, I shouldn't even be here today. But because I was able to take action, I'm cancer free, no sign of breast cancer, no sign of ovarian cancer, and I look forward to living a very long and healthy life.